Hey people, Egypt here, welcome back to the dead fire where we have to kill the queen. That's right, I was not expecting this. I thought they were gonna say, hey, we need help building our submarine, but nope, it's a coup. And we're involved because I'm committed to the Royal Dead Fire Company. We're gonna have to kill the queen. But before that, let's talk about bows. Hey there. Since the start of the game, we've been using this essence interrupter on Carillion. It's a good bow, high damage, has this soul diplomacy thing which sometimes summons something useful, sometimes just summons a cat that does nothing. But it served us well. The problem with it is the penetration. Really low. We've struggled sometimes with armor penetration on Carillion. It's only got a base of six. Looking through my weapons, at some point, I don't remember, remember when, we picked up Saint Omaku's Mercy and thankfully I didn't sell it because it's pretty damn good. At the time, I think I dismissed it because I like to summon things, but look at this. Base 8 penetration, plus 3 for superb, and plus 1 for the heavy draw. 12 penetration on this bad boy. The damage isn't quite as high, but I think the penetration is well worth it. It is a little bit slower because of heavy draw, but it gives us good damage because of survival and plus 1 pen. And this heal when killing stuff is alright. What can we enchant it with? We can't enchant it with Legendary because we haven't got Emeralds. I did read somewhere on a forum post that you can buy Emeralds in the Radiant Court. Now when I read that, it seemed familiar to me like I'd done it already. So I don't know if I did that in a previous playthrough or like 25 episodes ago and I just forgot. But we're going we're gonna to have a look at that again. So we can get Saint's Grace. More action speed as she loses health. That's alright. What is this that I can't get? Alright, oh, the heal. The arrow that heals, but also damages her. So we get Saint's Grace. And either Decisive Shots for even slower heavy draw. With, uh, well, replaces heavy draw. So even slower, more damage, and even more penetration. Or this, which I don't have the antlers for. Galloway's Harried. 50% chance to recover immediately on a crit. That's pretty good. But we'll take this. Consistent pain. For the enemy, that is. Boom. So we should be up to... 13 penetration now, right? And once we get it legendary, which hopefully happens, even more. Stop pressing the wrong buttons. Here we go. Yes, 13 penetration compared to 9. That's a big difference. Now, we don't have the shock damage anymore. It's pierce and slash, but I'm going to keep the essence interrupt over here in case the shock damage makes sense. And Saint Umaku's Mercy is now in there. Look at the size of it. I'm happy with that. So... I made some AI changes to our guys because we got some new skills and stuff. Techless. I why were you not on your AI? I made some changes to his defensive stuff, so he'll only try to cast Lingrath Safeguard if he's below 50%. If he's engaged by anyone, he'll cast Mirror's Mirrored Image. And also if he's below 50%, he'll do the Spirit Shield. I didn't want to put these two on the same thing. Because they'll, then, then they'll share the same cooldown. And Alariel, I made it Alariel the Radiant, that she'll cast Nature's Bounty right at the start of the fight. To put that into all of our quick slots and then she'll do her Watchful Presence. Which I like. Why is this zero cooldown? That's not right. It should be like a minute or something. Although we only have one cast at that level so it's not like she can spam it. But there we go. And I... And I've put a space in all my quick slots, as you yeah. saw last episode, I think. Hey Unless I did it off camera and forgot. For everyone to get yes. the benefit of the nature's bounty. Mm -hmm. Aside from Alariel, she's still full of scrolls. And uh, maybe I should remind myself as to what the hell it does. What does it do exactly again? It's, oh, more action speed, more health. Uh, well, a heal might, yeah, it's really good. It's really good. Let's leave here. The way they uh, gave me this quest, it made it sound like I'm not allowed to leave before I kill the queen. So I can't go to Radiant Court now and look for emeralds, I don't think, because they're going to start firing upon Queen's birth like now. Yeah, here we go. Four hour tie. Some big booms. Don't hit my ship, you guys. Also, I don't kill, his, kill any civilians. Oh. Do I still have a rest bonus? I do. K 
captain's banquet. Oh yeah, from when I was trying to kill that dragon, which didn't work out for me. Still annoyed at that. What is this? Saint's Grace. Wait, why does everyone get Saint's Grace? Right here. The hell? Wow, it's for everyone near her. That's amazing. That is amazing. Oh, do you want to join me yet, Amani? My hands are feeling better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I've uh -huh. heard stories about you. I just needed good Nekataka reputation. Could probably use. I'll see you on board. Yes, come and join me. She seems to be injured, still. Um. Okay. You're a three-star kind of near. We can use that, and you can replace. I think you have like nothing. Yeah. So you go down there. Wasn't there a? There was a merchant, wasn't there? The quartermaster that I, that would never talk to me. Can I talk to her now? Am I enough in their good graces that I already check her? I don't know. We'll see. It's hard to keep track of all the things you've done when you play sometimes days apart. Uh, yeah, she's here. Good to see you again. Can I sell? Of course. Ha! Now where did? Do you have anything good? Girdle of Mortal Protection. I think we have that already. We have that already. Bunton Belt. Just some exceptional stuff. I feel like I have spoken to you already. We can sell you stuff, I guess. I'm going to keep that torch. So you some of this non-unique junk. We'll keep the pistol. Sell the scepter. Get all of that. A ragged hood. Quick 30 grand. Oh, can I sell that stupid freaking this thing? This shade that always turns on me. Sell that thing. Uh, is that it? We can sell these traps. They can go away. Is this a minor healing potion? Is pointless to us. Some drugs over here. Some scrolls I'll probably never need, but I'll keep them there. Some more traps. Boom. Now let's go to murder the queen. Alrighty. I assume it's going to lock off queen's birth so I can't leave. Oh, it locks everything off. Aside from Serpent's Crown. So I can leave on foot, but I can't get into my boat without going to Queen's Birth. And I can't fast travel to the palace, obviously. It says infiltrate. I don't like being sneaky generally in games. Just brute force. Kill any oh boy, we got we fighting. No chances, tonight. no chances tonight. Fair enough, you are under attack, I suppose. Oh, let's throw your thing. Oh, it's AoE. Wait for stuff to get close to each other. Yeah, throw that. You. Uh, I'll use the uh, nature's bounty. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare. I'm going to have to turn everyone's AI off to use this. I don't even know what his boundless rage did. Looks like it hit. Everyone drink your bounty. Well done, put your AI back on and just mark someone. You, put your AI back on and do a dazing shout, there you go. You, AI back on and I want to use one of these. Maybe this, can I, I can't change the, uh, the size of it. Let's get some bless. Oh wow. That's a lot of stuff. Look at that damage. Holy crap, Teclis. Calm down, buddy. Okay, get out of here. Ouch. Die. Oh, he did die. Well done. Chain lightning in there. Uh, let's throw another weapon of boundless rage. Sure. That was fun. 
You stop buffing people up with this. Did you use your nature's bounty? You didn't. Give me that nature's bounty. And you now... Sure, throw that in there. And another chain lightning. Who's that? Someone's shooting from over here. Oh yeah, holy crap. Teclis is nuts now with his extra power level and... We got the Great Soul or whatever it was called for even more power level, didn't we? I think. He's going to use his Dazing Shout. Look at that. Now it does crush damage and dazes. Spirit Tornado time. That's right. Get out of there so don't get terrified. Did he put up his... No. Oh, he's not being engaged. That's why. Go on, Ungrim. Kick some ass in there. Wait, why are you on my team? Must have got charmed by something. Something that Texas did, I think. Let's uh, go. Wait, why are they terrified again? I don't know. I'll take it. I will take it. There's that heart seeker. Give me a twin shot. Throw out some of these simple spells. I don't think you need your torch. Come on, Valton, get a hit. Go on, son. 17. I think our hog hits for almost that much. There's this fella over here. Yes. Yes. Next fight, we'll try the meteor shower. Can't use that thing, unfortunately. A whirling cloak of black energy around a wizard. That'd be really cool for a melee wizard, but you need to be pure wizard to get that. Yes. That was an easy fight, but it was just some guards. As you like. I assume it's going to get tougher. What do you have? Just generic things. Oh, it's a bit... Even more loot. Oh, some fruit in there. Speaking of fruit, how are you guys doing? Oh, you're running out of it. And some more water there. It'll be fine. You'll be fine. Indeed. I guess we go over the bridge. There'll probably be more people outside the palace. They are being distracted by the Queen's birth shots, I suppose. What was that? Enemies ahead. Oh, right. They're right here. Well, this is the palace. This is where they would be. Let's try. Uh, meteor shower. Let's, let's have you drink the thing first. You. Give me a dazing shout. You. Over here onto the water shaper. You mark the water shaper. Get ready for some... Uh, interruptions, maybe. Let's have you drink your stuff. And you also drink the stuff. Yes. You, give me a bless, and then one of these, and then one of those. You, chuck your... Oh, did you do it? Chuck your weapon at someone first, do that. Alright, you. I'm just going to drop the meteor shout on our friends. It's not beyond you. Oh my god, you're annoying. There you go. It might hurt Ungrim a lot. I need to turn your AI back on. There must be a hotkey for that that I can do. Turned into a big wolf. Let's see what this meteor shower's like. I was really impressed with the other thing. What was it called? Missile Salvo. Doing pretty good. Ungrim's gonna survive, maybe? Taking a lot of damage. Do this, and then get your... So ideally, it would just be Valton in there. Wow, it's messing up my frame rate. That's what it's doing. That's a, that's a lot of damage, bloody hell. Teclis is bonkers now. Yes. Can I get a... Oh, did everyone just die? Oh, this guy got charmed by the meteor shower. So did this guy. Uh, guys, you can attack them. There we go. Yes. Let's do this thing. Oh, it's AoE. Not a very big AoE. I can make it bigger. There we go. Charmed again. Charming a lot of stuff. I, I don't think I can 
I need to check afterwards. I don't think I can change the uh, size of the meteor shower or the salvo. Let's go. Speed it up a bit. Come on, Valton, get a hit. There's something you don't see every day. Something else. Good stuff. Still one fella in there, the guard captain. Uh, Must be level 20, there's one skull on him. It's gonna go down. Yeah. Even Teclis is getting hits in. Take Automatically use his mirrored image as well, which is good. Uh. Ungrim got it. Let's make sure that's slowed back mm. down again all the way. Before the next fight. Okay, hey Teclis, I want to check your mm -hmm. stuff. This. Yeah, I can't. They don't have the little symbol to change their size. What was this thing called again? Prestige, that's it. More power level. So he is. He's got plus two evocation power level from his. Certainly. From being an evocation subclass. He's also got some from his gloves, isn't he? Yeah, plus one from his gloves and then plus one from prestige. Yes. That's why his spells are so insane. I guess we should just. Go straight to the upper floor, right? Because she's going to be on the roof. Let's quick save. Get ready for some murder. I wonder if I should put... Let me put... I can't pause it, can I? Oh. Looks like no one's attacking me now. I wonder if I should put the uh, circle of protection in her auto do it all the time thing I think so we'll put say a 30 second on it prioritize by you can't do anything okay we do need to move her off on her to get the best coverage that's the only problem I'll, I'll just do it myself it's not th something she can target. It's just around her. Okay, fair enough. Yes, I shall. Let's see what's up. In oh, let's go. We've got some enemies in there too. Oh, it's a big fight. It's a big one. It's a big one. Get in there. You guys can fight this fella. Where's Ungrim? Go on, son. You do that, and you are gonna drop a meteor shower in there. Right there. Yes. Would love to put this on you first. Let's try it. Oh, what? Someone's doing Garden of Life? But nothing's dead, is it? Oh, this is a lot of people. Okay, there's the Meteor Shower. Back away, Teclis. I said back away. There we go. And give me a Chain Lightning on this guy. He is marked, right? Yeah, that's going to move. Meteor Shower is doing work. You need to do this and this. And then maybe some of this. Okay, they all left the meteor shower. This is bad. Time for that. Time for you to do your daze and shout. And then throw this thing as well. You can do some of this. Valton okay? He's gonna heal himself, he's doing alright. That was a pretty pretty good meteor shower, I have to say. Those guys are gone. That weapon of Boundless Raid is pretty awesome. Now he's going to try and like barbaric smash someone to death. And did it. And he got an instant other hit and another hit. That was crazy. That must have been a kill and a crit. Look at that. It's gone ballistic. Just the palace archer left. Oh, this guy's left as well. Can we interrupt that? Nope, it went. Interrupt that vine, please. Should be able to do it. Maybe. Indeed. That's there's something you don't see every day. I think it did interrupt. I need to start casting somewhere else. Yes. You take them down. Excellent. Speed this up a bit now. How do you like that? I wonder if her brother's gonna be with her. 
Or maybe you fight the brother before, because he's usually on the floor below. That was a lot of loot. Can I please? Will do. There we go. None of it's anything particularly good, but it's taking a long time to loot all this stuff. Is there anyone else who wants to fight me? No, we're good. Rooftop, here we go. Quick save. Yeah, uh, quick save. I didn't do it. It didn't do it. It should auto save when we get up here though. And a quick save in case I die. Uh, where is she? I guess I just can't see her yet. I guess I get to talk to her. I say oh. that the days of shielding myself behind polite smiles are at an end. Yeah, she doesn't like her maybe very much. This is the city of my ancestors, and it whispers every truth to my ear. I knew death would come wearing an outsider's face. Um, surrender. I would give myself to the sea before I allowed my homeland to be wrested from the tribe. This is your mistake to regret. Consider your choices from Tangaloa's Maw. Alrighty. Alrighty. About to get in there. You. Weapon of boundless rage. Chuck it in there. You. Meteor shower or one of these? Meteor shower, I think. Oh man, the range is so crappy. You need to put yourself in danger. Sure, right there. That'll do. Uh, move up and give me one of these. Yeah. Oh no, he lost his stuff. Run away, take this, run away. He still has it there. He didn't take the cast away. So, like there, if you can get there safely. Come on. Mark the queen. Kill that queen. Where is Asrai? He's stunned. Come on, Asrai, move. There's the meteor shower. Move away, Teclis. Move away. Chuck in some other stuff. We got our bubble up, okay. Give me a moon well now, a nice big moon well. Meteor's doing its thing. Oh man, so is that. One of them over there now, please. She's dead already. Thought she'd put up a more of a fight than that. Teclis is getting hammered. Asrai is down. My frame rate is painful right now. Don't die, Teclis. Oh, he died. I'm going to have to freaking rest, am I? Got bruised ribs. It's not the worst thing. It's not the worst thing. Let's that down with an antidote. Right here. Uh, anything to interrupt? Not really. Why are you confused? Just attack this guy. That's how it's done. Let us end this. I shall. Another one of those. Yeah. Yeah. Should we try one of these? Sure. That was pretty effective. Kill them both. Give Let's me another... Go. Oh wait, Indeed. just give me this robust like this. There you go. Yeah, I'll be alright. Got rid of the weakened. Didn't actually get the robust then. Just cancelled the weakened. Oh. Uh, sure, stop buffing people I suppose. Then use some of this. Uh, oh, you can drink your nature's bounty. Right so can you. For a little bit of a heal. Huh? In fact, all of you, all of you have a swig. Right here. Hmm. Speed it up a bit. Poor Teclis. Maybe I should just revive him. I don't think it's going to even revive in time. There we go. Nice. Boom! Teclis is a beast now, but that meteor shower range 
makes it really dangerous to use sometimes. Need to be more careful with it. Do I just take the minus 20 fortitude? Yes. Still got 74. Mm -hmm. What does she have? She must have some unique loot, surely. No. I shall. Are you serious? She had no unique loot? I shall make it so. Or oh, did I see that wrong? Oh. Serpent Crown. Plus one intellect, plus one perception, plus ten accuracy. Oh, when critically hit. I'm sure it looks fancy. It's not bad. It is not bad. Do you have again? Plus two intellects. Melee weapon. Plus two intellects is all right. Shall we give you the crown? Doesn't really give you anything else. Toxic coils I never use. Don't do anything from stealth. Don't have any poison keywords. This gives you perception as well. And a buff if you get critted. <laughs> okay. Ooh, very nice. Very nice, he likes it. Let's save. Oh. And go back to the Hazanui. Is it gonna be clear? On the way out. Let's go down here. We're just gonna you're just gonna deal with your minus twenty fortitude, I think, Teclis for now. Look, I may have got you killed, but you need to live with it. Seems like the meteor shower really messes up my frame rate. I mean, it's a shower of meteors. Burned book grows warm in your pack. That means Wodeka wants to talk to me. I don't really want to talk to her. What do you want? Oh, these are the guys. Atsura. Sidestep in the twitching bodies and pools of blood. Expression is carefully inscrutable until he meets your eye. It's a terrible shame, this dreadful waste of life. Still, the skirmish here will forestall much longer, bloodier battles in the future. I hope that comforts you as much as it does me. Our soldiers have taken control of the district and will do the same throughout Mekitaka. The prince has fled, but there is little he can do now. The queen is dead, and the seat of power in Deadfire is ours. Where the hell was the prince? Very strange that he just run. Uh, not sure how I feel about this. You're responsible for the welfare of all Deadfire now, not just Rawatai. And we shall see to it. As for your passage to Ukaizo, Karu can introduce you to your conveyance. She shall meet you at the Brass Citadel by the docks. I shall return to my office in the Brass Citadel once I've seen to matters here. Good, good, good. My conveyance, eh? Brass Citadel, did he say? Yeah. Report to Hazanui at the docks. The bloody deed was done. The queen has fallen. Meteors on her face. Doesn't let me go to the Imperial Command here. A lot of fellas. You did it. You really pulled it off. Yeah, it wasn't very stealthy. You could have just sent your army to kill her. <laughs> You've given Rawatai a future. Thanks to you, we have only to seize it. Lots of XP. Nervous and excited soldiers. Major positive. I should bloody hope so. Promise me there will be no more casualties. You know I can't. Oh, balls. But we'll do everything in our power to limit them. Fair enough. We've no interest in governing corpses. 
But if our efforts are to mean anything, then we must get to Ukaizo. Come, it's time you saw what Okaya's engineers have been working on. Fun, fun, fun. You help Rawatai establish a foothold in Deadfire, and I promised you a way to Ukaizo. Wait quietly. Our engineers at Sayuka have developed a one-of-a-kind vessel that will give us mastery over the seas. Let's make loads and of you them. a means to reach Ukaizo. I give you the blade of Takoa. The blade of Takoa. Oh, oh! Wow, it's way bigger than Thanks I thought it would be. Engineer's dedication and Ivera's magic. The blade of Takoa can travel beneath the water. Ivera was the one that I that was in the crate that I took there, I think. The storms of Andra's mortar won't stop you. They won't even touch you. Impressive work, Hazanui. Let's be diplomatic. She loves it. Now comes the time to put it to use. You'll go to Ukaizo. Well. If our predictions are correct, there should be a way for you to disable the storms somewhere on the island. Not quite yet. I have two DLCs to do first and a whole bunch Once of other stuff. Once you've done that, the rest of our ships can secure it. And you can face Aethys. The ship will be waiting for you at Queen's birth. Try it out. See how it handles. Once you're ready, we'll follow you to Andra's Mortar. In the meantime, I'll be at Serpent's Crown. We've both got our work cut out for us. Oh, she gets the palace, eh? Hostile takeover. I've got three blessings for that. Awesome. So the main quest is now travel to Okaizo, which oh. is the last sure. segment of the game. So we're not going to do that now. That's for sure. City lost the time. Here it is. They will meet me there. Um, yeah, I'm gonna leave by sea. Oh, that's the th there it is. Let's have a look at it, shall we? I need to pull all my crew off. It's it's a small crew. It's got his guns, pretty good guns. It's a really small crew. crew. I'll get, I bet we get a smaller fighting force too. But I'm going to use it. So how do I quickly... I guess this I have to individually pull you guys off of here. And yeah, pull all these off, I guess. Can I even put other cannons in it? I don't know. Wait, where have my crew gone? Oh, they're automatically going into here. Fair enough. Uh, sure, we're not going to use this anymore. Just put everything off it. Can I even put... I can put uh, more stuff. I need to get a new helm. And a new anchor. Give my colours, give my sails. Does it use sails when it gets above water? I have no idea. Okay. Boat stuff. Sails. Oh, he can't change the sails. Fair enough. It doesn't use them. Can change the hull, apparently. What else can we put in here? Oh, I can't put my colours up either. Can you change the guns? Five turns reload, eight to eleven, one fifty to four hundred. So they're longer range. Let's just keep them. Lanterns. Oh, you can't change them. Doesn't let you change anything, really? Okay. I guess we're in here now. Um, I need to work out who's best for everything. Are these my best deck hands? I think so, yes. What about my best cannoneers? Got a triple there, but these are already triples. Um, you're not a surgeon at all. I don't know why you're there. Don't I have a better surgeon than this? A four-star surgeon. Get in there. I need a navigator. Hmm. 
You're a really good cannoneer. You're not a good helmsman, so I don't know why you're there. You're my helmsman, right? Well, you're three stars. Oh, you're really good at both of those things. But I don't have another good navigator, do I? Nope, I barely have another one at all. So you go there. You go there. Who's the best deck hand I have now? I don't really have many good ones. Hmm. You're a really good deck hand, but you're a really good surgeon too. Okay, there's a two star over here. You get in there. And you're a really good bosun. I don't seem to have a slot for that anymore though. No, no bosun slot. Who else can we... You're really good. You're an amazing cannoneer, actually. You should be in there. That's all you do. So we'll put you there for a bit of versatility on the bench there. Are you the best cook I have? Probably. You're a four. Okay. We are in a submarine. This is to get extra quarters and stuff, which we never bought. Let's leave by sea. Or do we want to buy those extra quarters? I don't think it matters. Let's leave by sea. So all of that effort getting that big boat and... Uh, oh, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I stop this? I wanted to level up my other guys. Well, there it is. The steward would like to speak to you. Okay, first I want to level up my other fellows because I've got some sea fights to do, I think. Wild Mare. Now, hey, Gintel. what can I do for you? You see anything you like? You'll come back. They always do. And after that we need to level up those two as well. Shouldn't take long. Um, You're a conjurer. You conjure this crazy bow. Sure, that keeps you at range at least. Steel spells. Piercing sigil. When striking melee, they do some damage. Or that thing. Um, none of that seems particularly useful. Uh, sure, get Martial Caster since you'll be summoning that bow. Good, good, good. Anything. Got another level. No idea what to get. Don't want to give her too many things to use, you know? Is this thing again? Gives her a bunch of buffs. Spell shaping. I've no idea if the AI even does that. Take some will. No new power level yet. I don't know if they're going to get to it. More reflexes? Sure. Paul France. Sure, take this. Um, ooh, clear out. We'll clear the path. Fight when I'll push back enemies in a line. Hits all enemies around him. Okay, what is this? Inspired discipline. Gather your thoughts and get a bunch of buffs. Fair enough. Oh, we'll take that. What is this? Critical defense. All... Oh, percentage of all crits turn to hits. Fair enough. 
Toughened Fury. Gain discipline every time they are crit. A 10% chance though only. He's not going to be crit very much. But I guess we'll take it. Improved crits maybe. Sure. Improved crits. That's you done. I don't know. The weird hat. What is this? Switch positions. I don't want you doing that. Confusing people. Don't know what, what else to give you, buddy. Slippery mind. Okay. Um... A great soul? No, we don't want a great soul. A sap, maybe? Leaves them confused? Sure. Oh, we can get the next level of it. Enemies that the target strikes also become confused. Fair enough. Um, whatever. Take anything. I bet Alithanar would have been good to, to uh, try and take that dragon down with his icy bow. Um, Relentless Storm is pretty good, but I don't want you standing around casting stuff, really. I guess it doesn't matter. Give him Relentless Storm. It'll be fun. Ranger stuff. Have you interrupt, maybe? Let's get your pet. Some stuff, perhaps. Oh, we already upgraded that. Evasive roll. Predator's sense. Sure. What else can we grab here? Don't want to give you any summons, really. What is this? Venom Bloom. Okay. Rot Skulls. Ranged weapon that does things. More crit damage. Spell resistance. Martial caster. Quick summoning. Give me this. Crit damage. Oh, one for both classes. Play dead? No, I don't think so. What about some defenses, eh? Yeah. Don't want you getting charmed or whatever. Um, Axes. Can't even remember. Are you using a saber right now? Fair enough. Hey, no. Gintel. You see anything you like? Need my other bozos. I didn't check to see if I had stuff to give them. Whatever, they'll be fine. Oops. Fascina. All right, you're down here. You've already got that in your book. Don't have this. Take this. It's an awesome spell. Another ability as well. Ward of Draining. Might just take defenses. Corrode, maybe you do a bit of corrode, don't you? Yeah, that corrodes. And isn't this corrode yet? That's raw. Sure, we'll take a little bit of corrode penetration. Uh, a rod. Uh, I've got all the defensive buffs already. The hell do I take with you? I don't know if the AI uses empowers. And if they are, they're not getting them back. Sure, a wall of flame. No, don't take a wall of flame. <laughs> Try and steal some spells, sure. Now what? Anything. Spell shaping, maybe. Maybe you'll do it. Okay. Edwin. You should have stuff to get. Amplified Wave. Mind Plague. Disintegration. Bloody hell. What does it roll against? Fortitude. It's good against casters. I like this. And Cyphers are really cool. 
and a withering strike or a toxic strike. Let's go toxic. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. There was a reason I didn't give you this, wasn't there? Thick smoke distract. Yeah, I don't want you doing that. Try and dominate and charm people? Sure. Is there anything obvious I can give you guys? Are oh, you pretty well kitted up here? Could give you some trinkets maybe? Lost in time. They're per rest though, you're never going to get the rest back. Uh, sure, take the weird hat. Any more weird hats we have? We have this thing. Grazes to misses, that's alright. That is all right. You mean to push and pull? Agrasima, how you dote on me, Captain? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Calm down. Well, can you see anything you like? That'll do. As you say. The A team is back. Quick save. Do I want to talk to Wodaka? Not really. Shall we just do it? Where is this book anyway? So this, open it. That display the hangar pads. There's no no voice acting. It was shameful to witness. Nothing nothing less than proof of why mortals require capable rulership and a strong hand. When I walk among them again, chaos of that sort won't be tolerated. Authority and temperament are non-negotiable. Uh, you blame mortals when a god is the one sowing chaos. Aethos has done nothing but expose an existing fault, one which would have cracked even if we hadn't let it be, if we had let it be. My siblings took a valiant swing at Aethos, but it seems our intervention will have to wait until we've had time to gather our strength. What of you, Watcher? Your bearing is set and the Kaizu looms on the horizon. After everything you've seen, do you believe mortals are equipped to take control of their destiny, or do you need a firmer hand? Um... Mm. Firm hand crushed my castle. I could have done without that. Your heart is thick with vengeance, even in defiance you serve me. Do you serve me? Find Aethes, follow him to Okaizu, and let my justice fill your sails. How my siblings preened and postured after the events at Hosongo, but came no closer to consensus. I cannot stomach such disorder. We didn't need to reignite the Ardra lighthouse. You helped the colony knowing that Aethas was already moving towards Okaizu. Why? Um, Rautai deserved to have the lighthouse back. Payment reward. Ardra is no good to the Valians if it's been... We'll go back to Rautai. Now you've seen what can happen when mortals assemble to meet a crisis head on. Collaboration on that scale is rare but also unreliable. My more compassionate and optimistic siblings are no doubt overjoyed, thinking you've somehow gotten the better of me. How wrong they are. I notice my brother's frozen corner of the beyond is quieter than usual. Okay, you're talking about the uh, Beast of Winter stuff. You made it out of the White Void intact. Has anything you witnessed on the other side informed your opinion of the Mortal World Watcher? Um... I saw how gods and mortals can cooperate through Widewind's eyes. If you can call that cooperation, as long as you realise that mortals are tools to serve our ends. Anything else? No, go away. Remember what you've learned. It might not save your life, but mortals could do worse and enjoy a broadened perspective. Why does she care? Regicide. What a shameful turn of events and a loathsome indictment of mortal society. The, K the Kanga dynasty was far from perfect, but it was a critical to the survival of lesser tribes. Others depend on their strength and contributed to what they had in times of need. Chieftains rise and fall, but in these vulnerable times, I fear the Kahanga have been struck a killing blow. Probably. Sold of its land to outsiders. If they deserve to rule, they will outlast it. 
and he did it to send the message. Yeah, the Kahanga weren't great. Your criticism is fair. In biding her time, the Queen turned a blind eye to the plight of her people. But does that justify violent perversion of order? I think not. The Kahanga were an avenue for mortals to accomplish together what I would inflict on them by force. My outlook on them is bleak. No surprise that the Principe should face a crisis of leadership, much less that you chose to involve yourself, Watcher. With Eldis and a failed mutiny set aside, yeah, I killed her, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I did. One hopes that the captains will fall in line and recall the meaning of obedience. An indomitable threat lies on the horizon. They will not last. Good. I hate pirates. So, another of Nekataka's dirty secrets comes to light in a spectacularly dramatic fashion. Dragon beneath their streaks. That was ages ago. Much less the eyes of royalty. I killed it, right? I'm pretty sure. Say nothing. We observe closely, yeah, yeah, yeah. Such a waste. You killed the upstart pirate and put an end to his delusions of grandeur. Bravo. Talking about Benweth, I think? Slaying a ruthless and effective leader. She likes righteous vengeance. Beginning to question my trust in you, Watcher. Sacred communion, you conduct it beneath any acceptable standard. I didn't ask for your weird book. Even though you live up to my admittedly low expectations of mortals, know that I am displeased. And there's a dangerous way to approach me. No power over me, I owe you nothing. Very well then. I'm the one at fault for putting any trust in confidence or confidence in you. From now on, you do well just to leave my book shut forever. Good. Wodica nods stiffly. You feel her presence drift as a breeze, rustling as it goes. Ashley Johnson t chiming in. Okay, that's Wardica. She's cranky as usual. I want to get to the Radiant Court before this episode ends to see if I can buy emeralds. Oh, the steward wants to talk for the DLC. That's how it starts. She calls you in for a chat. How do I get to my bloody submarine? Over here, oh, there it is. Looks pretty cool, you guys. It's very. How do you even. Can you even fight on this deck? I don't know. It's very small. I wonder. Am I gonna have to fight at sea and stuff? I don't wanna do that. Leave by sea. Let's see if we can get into a fight or something to see how this works. Because if not, I'm going to go back to my other boat, which is going to be annoying. And then just use this to go to Okaizo. Quick save. Go to the steward. Oh, there's it's enough space to fight on here. Should be fine. How do I go down? Okay. your time watcher if you will yes some of the hands discovered an unusual crate in the ship's hold how did the crate get into my ship on notice unfortunately the ship lacks the defensive fortifications of cad Nua. a crate could have been slipped aboard at any of our ports of call assuming it wasn't placed among our goods as we took on supplies i'll go see what it is the hands left the crate in the hold if you wish to okay there it is Oh, Super God. dark. The scents of food, salt, spices, and drink mixed with the stale odor of old grass. The musty stink of rats and the ever-present fragrance of the sea. Why do the old grass here? Submarine rocks gently. You can hear faint whispers. Not far, not far in. You find the crate in question. Looks pretty fancy. Its sides split by crowbars. Oh, the grass is in there. Used as packing material, spilled across the floor. The front of the chest bears an iron latch affixed to a complex iron mechanism. Examine. I can't do it. Let's just open it. I turn the latch to the right and a series of metal arms shift with it. Okay. It's a head. Oh, an arm iron head. Mottled flesh of its neck raggedly cut free from the rest of its body. Wherever that may be. 
So you peer down to the head, at the head, you feel a strange prickling sensation along your skin. Am I going to do watcher stuff? It begins to take shape before you. What is this? Oh, hey. You can see me. It's really you then, the captain of the Defiance. Yep, it's a submarine, but yes. Oh, this is fantastic. How satisfying it is to know one did not give one's life in vain. Alrighty. I come from the island of Kazuwari, and we need your aid. What kind of aid do you need? Who are you? How do you come to be dead? What kind of aid do you need? Kazuwari is an island where the most skillful hunters, the most hardened explorers, the deadliest warriors, all gather to earn Tuamowai's favor. What the hell's Tuamowai? Is it Galawain? Yeah. But Humaire, the island's caretaker, says the essence that sustains the island has sickened. Curdled, she called it. The animals, the trees, they all churn with anger and fear. Mm-hmm. Why haven't I heard about this place? I'm the greatest warrior. I can't explain the whims of Tuamawai. Perhaps you might have with time. But only Tuamawai's best beloved are welcome there. Only they can truly appreciate what it offers. Why you ask me? We need a watcher. No one else can talk to souls, Humaire said. And souls are our problem. You're a watcher, right? The watcher. The one who died and lived again. Who speaks to the gods. That's the watcher we need. You caught me. I knew it. I knew Humaire wouldn't have lied. You will help. Won't you? Why did you chop your own head off? What do I need to do? What do I oh, need to do? that's fantastic. Thank you. Speak to Humaire at Kazuari, Watcher. She'll be able to better explain the situation than I am. Alrighty. Kazuari's a huge island west of Hasango. It's pretty hard to miss, what with the high cliffs and waterfalls. There's one thing you should know. The faces of the hunt jealously control who enters and leaves the island. Oh, is that why I had to kill his zombies on elf? But there's a waterfall on the southern side of the island that will allow you to sneak in, so long as you're circumspect. Well, I'm always circumspect. I guess you should also know. What? The island's residents might not take too kindly to your presence if you're found. They're, um, a prickly bunch. But I'm sure that won't be a problem for you. I'll help however I can. I killed a queen, but once we've arrived, I can help you find your way into the heart I'm, of I'm the nice. island. You know, kind if of. You want me to? I wouldn't want to presume. Find your way to the heart of the island. In the meantime, okay. I'll be here. Okay, well, I'm really, head. with the rest of the spirits following you. Oh, around. it's a trinket. I think. Sail to Kazuwari. Is it a trinket? It is. Grant Muatu's aid. Oh, it's a summon. Awesome. Muatu's attacks heal the, heal the wielder if they are nearby and become more powerful as he is empowered by the souls of the crucible. What are we using right now? Winter's Veil that we don't really use that much. It's not bad, but I mean 8.4 seconds. Let's get a summon. Carry this fella's head around. Sure. Hmm. And a quick save. So that is the opening of the second DLC. What a second DLC that was released. Seeker. Hunter. There it is. Seeker Slayer Survivor. There we go. The Proving. Sail to Kwasawari. Well, first, mm -hmm. I want to get some emeralds, please. And I think we'll do some more stuff here and there before we go to the DLC area. We'll probably be level 20 before we go there. What level am I now? Oh, very nearly level 20. Uh, yep, yeah, go up. See if we can get into a quick fight. And if those guys sell emeralds, I'll be very happy. Who are you? Just a merchant. You are Valiant Trading Company Master Captain. Let's fight you. I can board. Awesome. Let's see what this looks like and how many people I get. I'm guessing I'm only going to get four and not six, which kind of sucks, but hey, it's a, it's a cool-ass submarine. Yeah, I think that's two on each side. Can't see the right side. Whoa, there's one over there. Slow it down. There's two, yeah, there's two on each side. We've got a Phantom's Fascina. I think it just selects them at random. I'm not sure how it's going to work. Uh... You, why are you so close to people? Get away. 
give me some of this. Like right there. You're doing your watchful presence. You chuck a weapon at those guys. That's gonna be fun. You mark over there. Look at that. Oh man, we almost killed Valton. Holy crap, there must have been a double cast or something. He's using re this is reforged the flesh here. That was pretty effective. Come on, attack stuff, dude. There you go. Yeah, you healed yourself. You're alright. Give me one of these. I need to be careful with the auto cast for this because if he's not engaged, he's not going to use it. Move away. Get some chain lightning. Right here. Uh, you, How do you like that? attack some stuff, dude. What are you doing? You're aggressive. There he goes. He can't move. Oh, this thing's annoying. This is going to block a lot of pathing, isn't it? Can we even jump around, actually? Can we jump over? I don't know if we can. I don't know if we can. Uh, mess up this priest. Don't want him casting things. Try this. Come on, Moonwell. Are you take some of this? Do some of that. Another one of these, please. Oh, old Techless is gonna die again. Don't die again. Uh, give me one of these things. You think your bounty? Oh, it's messed up my. Order here a lot, so I don't know why it does this sometimes on ship battles. You have some of that as well. You also drink some star. Okay. No, no, no. Like that. I think you can just move away from here, right? He's down. He's all the way down. What's the second one? Bruised ribs and frostbite. Oh, mm -hmm. Balls. Try this. Tia. Now where were we? Give me a dazing shout. Got to try something else. Huh? What are you doing, Carlton? Just attack. These priests are really annoying. Really annoying. I guess we can use our stuff since we're gonna rest anyway. Not my best moment. Jump away, Carillion. <laughs> Hold on. Don't chase her. Let's go. She's not interested in your chasing. My pleasure. Yes. Give those heals. I'll get the next one. Meanwhile, take this is back up. They're attacking Carillion again. Give me that Moonwell. Oh, I guess I can... Let's summon Mwatu. Where is it? Is this him? Oh, Mwatu. You can also get these guys up. I'm not going to use my summon items though, I don't think. I swear you guys have been attacking this fella forever. Hurry up. That's Orion and Carl Franz. Hungrim's over there. You can empower yourself and then Spirit Tornado and go mental. Some fantastic friends. Fascina's all the way over there. Heal yourself a bit. People are getting paralyzed left and right. It was a tough fight. I underestimated this fight. Man, I'm going to lose my Captain's Banquet heal uh, rest. That sucks. Maybe I have some more of those potions to remove injuries. 
Go on, Tungrim. Okay, we can jump. We can jump. It's going mental over there. What about you now? Let's try to get some buffs out. You. No idea what we're going to do with you. When the fight becomes messy like this, it's hard for Teclas to do his AoE stuff. Give me another one. Give me one of these when you can. Just queue it up, I suppose. Did it work? You didn't queue, you didn't queue. Do it. There we go. Now move. Let Ungrim smack people. Move, I said. Or just stand there. It's fine. That's not it. It's fine. Oh, we can throw another one of these up, can't we? That Lengrath safeguard, that's good. And one of these would also be good. And then put one of these, I suppose. Gotta be faster on that healing. Oh, Valton's gonna heal him as well, well done. Oh, he healed Asrai. Teclis is down again. This has been a bad fight. These guys are tough as hell. Look at their defenses. Did you get poisoned? I don't think so. They are dodging everything. 128 deflection on those guys. Can we get a nature's mark, please? Try that. I'm going to empower you for a bless, I think. Not quite. That's not supposed to a happen. big bless. Come on, Orion. Hey, Enchantress, did anyone else die? Where is Fasina? Oh, she's over there. All right. Just Teclis. Let's speed it up a bit here. Not sure who you're healing. Oh, that's right again. What's their armor like? 14, 15 ish. What are you doing? Form of the Delam gun. I don't want anyone else to die, please. Okay, it's just this fella left. Take him out. Tough as hell. I'll just have to try something else. Okay. Do we have the potions to get rid of the injuries? Didn't even drop anything good. But at least we know we can we can board with the submarine. Okay. Techless. Potions. Is it this? Nope. Concentration and cannot die for 6.3 seconds. I think I used them all. Can I make more of them? I think it's under healing. It's this one, isn't it? Yeah. And it removes all injuries. Bloody hell. I don't have any more of these things. Just make sure I don't have it. Does it tell me what it looks like? It's this thing. So this is it? Aha! So next time we're on land somewhere, we'll have you drink that. We want to go to the Radiant Court. Firstly, where is the DLC place? Oh, there's a Kaizo. Okay. We do have like this bounties and stuff up near Margaret's Teeth. It's quite freaking far, isn't it? What was the name of the place? Didn't it begin with K? No? I've got no K's. Isn't it? I swear it was something with K. Let me press the right thing. The proving. Yeah, Kazuwari. Am I just missing it? I do not see Kazuwari here. Um. Well, they said it was like west of Hosongo, right? Where's Hosongo? 
there. Was it west? There it is. Kazawari. And we can get in on the waterfall, he said, I think. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff to do there. There's Mira Self and the Truly Insane as well. But I want to go to... Not Dunnage. Where was it? Oh, it was Dunnage, I think. That's where the Radiant Court is. Oh, what now? The wind carries an unusual sound to your ears. Why are we not under the water right now? A distant roar? It's a dragon. Uh... Oh, is this Lengrath? The later order will find out what they want before scrambling to the defences. Let's find out what they want. Be diplomatic. Yes, Lengrath. Who I killed in the first game, but I think they like reincarnate into different bodies or something weird. For a second I thought it was that freaking fire dragon coming for us. Lengrath is one of the arch mages or arch wizards or whatever they're called, which is why Watcher she's got spells named if after her. I might her. have a moment of your time. Uh, yeah, I killed I killed her in the first game. And her dragons. Didn't I kill you once Didn't already? Stick, I'm afraid. Yeah, she just like reincarnates. Our misunderstanding care. was unfortunate. You manipulated me, manipulated me into killing console hot and then tried to kill me to cover your tracks. Or we can just glare silently. The past is behind us. Let's focus on what's ahead, or rather, below. I okay. see a truant member of the Circle of Archmagi, Maura. She Maura. sent a rather cryptic word that she'd found something of cataclysmic potential in the Black Isles. Something that could aid you in the fight against Aeothus. You've aided the Circle of Archmagi once before. We've Arch found Magi. ourselves wondering if you might do so again. Um... As Where do we soon start? as you're able, Maura's drive is frightening, foolhardy, and her love of the dead fire uncompromising. We must make sure she doesn't destroy Aeora in an attempt to save her archipelago. I will await you in the Black Isles, a volcanic chain in the southeastern sea, due south of Tikawara. Don't tarry over long, Watcher. Well, I've got a bunch of stuff to do, Lengrath. I have been there before. It's the uh, it's where that maze was. That whale maze, maze. So this is setting up the third DLC, the Forgotten Sanctum. Okay. Dramatic entrance from Lengrath. I'll get onto that soon-ish, maybe. It's all the way down here. All of the unseen. That's the Black Isles. Uh, can I get back to Dunnage, please? I think this is the right place. Morale is okay, nobody's injured. Hull health is 80, I don't know if that's good or not. Don't remember what the other boat had. Seems quite quick. The old submarine. You find yourself in cold, suffocating darkness. What? A what? There is a familiar weight in your hand. A lantern. It sputters to life, and the world shifts into focus. A staircase spirals endlessly below you. With nowhere else to go, you start down. I have no idea what this is. A wave of blistering oh, heat to me again. hits you. Then a sea salt wind. Divine voices boom and screech. Their words shake the platform beneath you. Shake the very air around you. The gods are fighting. Skane's not here and Rimmingan's not here. They're both really cool. Lay your blame elsewhere, Wardica. I won't suffer your arguments any longer. Magrin looms large before you, an accusing finger leveled at the melted visage of Wodica. Trying to do, just trying to get some emeralds, you guys. Do you have any? Wodica screws her mouth into a sneer. You fool! 
If only we had attacked him when I first proposed it. Accusations drip bitter as bile from her tongue. Um. Say nothing. Wow smiles. Enmity and animus. Watcher. Two old songs we sing in well practiced harmony. Unable to reach accords, we compete to see whose shouts best shake Eora. The pallid knight looks down at you, a frown etched deep in her otherwise statue still features. I am afraid we are not at our best. The watchers return. Perhaps we should hear what he has to say. Helia's birds chatter anxiously among themselves. Wal's many eyes alight on each god in turn. We make little enough progress on our own. Are we planning something new? We try, but agreement eludes us. Andra's storm dark eyes swivel to meet yours. Is there nothing we can do? Magrin glances at the pallid knight from the corner of her eye. After a thoughtful pause, she speaks. The time has come for us to seize the power we have long left untouched and absorb our scattered children. Yeah, talking about the godlikes. Andra nods, her lure bobbing bright. Terrible though it would be, perhaps you are right. Didn't Margaret mention this once before? I did, and I was scolded like a child for my terrible audacity. A curl of steam rises from her nose. The pallid knight looks on. Should we be killed, we may possess the bodies of our godlike children. Or should we face a force too powerful to stand against, we can absorb their souls, granting us additional strength. What? Yes. Thousands of their lives would be forfeit to serve the greater good. The pallid knight speaks with the chilly temperance possessed only by the god of death. Who's good? Yours? We are your gods. Forged of thousands upon thousands of willing souls sacrificed on the altar of progress. Yes, our good is greater, but the time for that plan has long passed us by. Are we to keep nothing for ourselves? Not a single secret retained? Not a solitary mystery? Wild is upset that Pallid Knight tells me everything. Magrin elbows one of Wal's floating eyes away. Aethys will lay bare our every secret soon enough. What is one or two revealed now? But we get ahead of ourselves. First, the Watcher must get to Kaizo, and that will be a trial all its own. Um. Say nothing. The Guardian Sorry. of Ukaizo has stood watch over that place for millennia. It will not stand aside, not even for Barith's Herald. Helia, who had been lost in quiet, anxious conversation with her birds, breaks in. It yet lives. Of course. Our progenitors crafted it. A pair of Helia's finches come to join Wal's floating eye. They hover just out of Magrin's reach and swoop in to poke her when she's not looking. <laughs> and the Watcher will be forced to reckon with it if he wishes to confront Aethys. I will reckon with it later. The birds at last linger too long, and Magrin slaps them away. They burst into a cloud of essence, then reform and fly in a screeching chorus back to Helia. This garden is but one more thing that will fall before me aside from the dragon that I can kill. Ah, there is that heady mix of kiss ferocity and hubris Margrin so admires. Go prepared, Watcher. The Guardian will not stand aside, not even for the Herald of Barath. You already told me that. Won't Aethys take care of it? It is not one of Galloway's mindless beasts. It has a heart and a mind. There is Galloway even. It will throw even. neither away to oppose Aethys. And Aethys will not fight the creature. It would prove little more than a distraction for him, especially as my tsunami and Margrin's volcano couldn't stop him. Can't you just get rid of it? It is its own creature, Watcher. It does not listen to us. There is another topic we have yet to address. The Pallid Knight holds up one gauntleted hand. And the other gods fall silent. Tell me, Watcher, where do you stand? What do you think of Aeothus's scheme to destroy the wheel? Um. Kith will have to figure this out on her own. Perhaps you misunderstand. This is not a test you will overcome on your own. 
Aethys intends to change the fundamental structure of life and death. Well, you would say that. Does that not frighten you? You, Kith, who are most vulnerable? Oh, not their fear rule me. Aethys loves the mortals more than any of us. He has always been their greatest champion. He believes Kith will rise to his challenge. I am not so sure. But I look forward to watching them try. Say nothing. What if Aethys is right and Kith succeed in rebuilding the wheel? What then? We will make our world without you in it. Such hubris. Kith will make a mess of things. You cannot help yourselves. You must be controlled, lest you stray and fail. And what if they fail? Then they die. And so do we. We have to help them. Helia's voice rises, near to panic. Warica drives her fist into her hand. Help them! We should finally bring them to heal! The pallid knight raises a hand and stares at Warica until she falls silent. Watcher, Aethys yet values your counsel. The pallid knight's eyes bore into yours. An impassioned plea from the Hound of Aethys may still temper his actions. Confront him at Ukaizo. Say nothing. Time moves swiftly away from us now. The pallid knight spreads her hands before her. Go, Watcher. Do what you must. The edges of your vision begin to dim. Like a sun setting, twilight encroaches on your mind. The pallid knight conjures a blinding white light in her palm that swiftly grows to engulf the room. Then, the crack of thunder rends the air and you feel the floor drop out beneath you. You come to flat on your back, staring at an all too familiar ceiling, alone once again. Alrighty, lots of things going on. Gods are bickering as usual, but uh, as usual also, it's up to me to stop things happening. Right. They can't do anything apparently. But I'd like to get to the Radiant Court please, I just want emeralds. Radiant Court. Are they going to talk to me? I did try to kill all the pirates. I'm not sure where exactly in the Radiant Court it is. It might be the little... I don't know. There's another little inside area as well. In the top right corner. It's not you, is it, Berna? Not holding out on me, are you? What can I stock you up with? To... Yeah, they want, they're charging me more because they don't like me very much, but fair enough. Nope, you don't have any. Do you have some Mohora meat? And row? I'll buy all this stuff. Luminous lobster. What is this? Just an ingredient. Okay. Pork, poultry. That'll do. Ah, the treasure trove. Come on. That's somewhere that would have gems and stuff, surely. Have I been here before? I vaguely remember you. Demessa, do you have any emeralds? So our charted routes were destined to oh, cross course. Have. Trouble in my shop, and it'll be the last thing you do. Mark my words, squab. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything in my trove... Sun and Moon, Mirror Back, Reflect Spells, Void Ward. Okay, aha! Two emeralds, you guys. Give it. Give me some pyrite. Give me all this stuff. All of it. Minor Deflection Ring, Iridescent Scale. Well, it's got a summon on it. Conjure Greater Blight. I do like summons. A bunch of defenses against electricity, fire, frost, water. What is Alarial even using right now? Just a robe. Yeah, that's the reason I didn't get this, because it's got recovery time on it. 
Do not like recovery time. Okay, we'll just buy all this stuff. Finally, get a legendary weapon for Kirillian. And it's going to be this, the Saint or Marcus Mercy. Legendary. 60 grand. Boom. Awesome. 14 penetration. Love it. Love it. Look at that damage now too. Okay, finally. How do I leave? Ready, cool. I don't know where I'm going to head now. There's a bunch of stuff in the top left we never did. That's where the Wahaki tribe and stuff are. Maybe I'll go up there and see what's going on. If I see... Let's just sail up there. Before I end this episode, which has gone long again. Um, oh, there's the DLC area. This fog bust up here. Faster, there we go. Yeah, all this stuff. Crookspore, we've done. But Junvik Village. And this place, let's try and get to this place. Can you manage that? Pathfinding? It's gonna try. I'll do it myself. I'm gonna fog bust a bit. Morale is okay, they're still eating fruit and drinking water. Not too bad, fruit and water. Land ahoy. Just a water thing and, oh, some stuff. Vampire's Crypt. Bent Bow Forest, is that how you say it? Some stuff to explore. Maybe we'll just do that island. Next. It's right here, sure. But this will be the next episode. Let's save that. Thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.